They do appear, Jim Beglin, to be going with a 5-3-2 formation. Well, it could be a disguise, Peter, for something else. And that five at the back can easily produce wing-backs. If that's the case, I think, you know, it might end up a three at times. Uh, admittedly, though, if they do play deeper and in line with the centre-backs, then we can um, take it that they don't really want to give much away. That will be foremost in their minds. But essentially, it depends on the two wide players in that defence. If they push on a little bit more, we could see something very different. So that's got things on the way. Konoplyanka. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Tries to get it forward quickly. Deftly done. Keeps everyone guessing. He's got options out wide. Has a hit! He's got away with one there. Stepanenko, anything noteworthy in the early part of the match, Jim? Well read, he sorted that out. Keeper goes long. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Aimed long and direct. Konoplyanka. Shakhtar Donetsk have had plenty of possession, but few, if any, genuine chances. Konoplyanka. Oh, and he's got good distance. Who's chasing? This is promising. And it's been taken straight back. There's the delivery. Knocks it away. He's found his man. And it's Konoplyanka. So who can spark this game into life? And that's not going to reach. <laughs> Whistle's gone, that's a uh, foul. Forward it goes. Konoplyanka. Konoplyanka. And helps available out wide.
And it's the goalkeepers to claim. There's the whistle for half time. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. Some first half thoughts. Unspectacular, but solid, and that solidity could yet be the foundation for them to, to go on and win. Shakhtar Donetsk head to the dressing room, not yet having broken through. Tight, cagey game. Neither team any further forward than they were when they started out. Well, the action has already resumed here. Shakhtar Donetsk can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency. Goes for goal! Wow, looking at that, the defence was beaten. Oh, good ball. And he's onside. Shakes the shoots. And shoots! It's there! Well, what a time for the captain to step up and put his team in front again. But while it doesn't necessarily guarantee a win here, it's a wonderful early boost in this second half. He was really quick to react to the initial save, and he has his reward. Well, for me, that's just pure predatory brilliance. It's not so much the finish, but the way he read the situation when nobody else was even alert to it. It's fantastic. Shakhtar Donetsk take the lead. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement from the manager during the break can often straighten things out, and it's paid off here. And helps available out wide. And the flag has stayed down. Gets up to head it! He's done very well to get to that. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Up for the header. It's in. Great corner, and he did the rest. Well, look, it's it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle. But that was beautifully met, it really was. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you're pegged back again. Can he deliver? Koroplianka plays it out to the wing. Can he put it away? And it's hoisted clear. Well, it's normally around now that the managers think about making changes. Plays a clever pass. 
Not much subtlety, he's launched himself there. Knocks it away, tries to get it forward quickly. No complaints about that challenge, robust but fair. It's pretty clear that he's being singled out. Yeah, and if he's allowed time on the ball, it opens up a wealth of other possibilities. Deflected behind for a corner kick. They've managed to get it away. He's in! And a shot! Tries to stroke it through. And that's been levered clear. And he just whacks it away. Shakhtar Donetsk merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Pietov gets it upfield. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. He's got through. And it's Konoplyanka. That's a promising ball. Shot at goal! Oh, that's incredible! And that may just do it! Perfect placement. The one place the keeper couldn't reach. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Shakhtar Donetsk take the lead. Now it's just a question of holding on. There's still a bit left in it, Peter, but they... Sh oh, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Shakhtar Donetsk need to hold on for a few more moments. Boots it to safety. <laughs> Played out to the right. That's a brilliant interception. And that is that. Shakhtar Donetsk come out on top. Hard fought, impossible to predict. In the end, though, only the result mattered. Thrilling, nail-biting, perhaps frustrating until the very end. But we do have a winner.